Okay, so uh, here we have the uh, ballast unit for my Coral Life 9 watt twisty whatever UV light uh, sterilizer for my fish tank. Um, the first ballast that I had lasted about nine months. I replaced it under warranty. The second one lasted about a year, and uh, it's 60 bucks to replace it with, and that comes with the whole unit. Um, Normally I would do that, but uh, it was actually out of stock when I was looking for it, and the blue-green algae problem in my fish tank is becoming quite a nuisance at this point. But I wasn't willing to buy a whole new unit. Uh, so thankfully I found this 9-watt ballast on Amazon. It, it is a Robertson SP79P, which I actually got for a whopping $1.90. Uh, it was like $7 to ship it. but. Um, Thankfully it works. Uh, didn't come with any instructions. Um, I made some assumptions and connected it and uh, so far so good. Uh, the shorter lead that came with it is the um, input. So you connect that black wire from the uh, outlet to that. Um, the longer lead goes to the output which goes to the light. And um, I made some assumptions here and just connected the uh, neutral and ground wires as pass-throughs. I haven't finished hooking those up yet, but I do want to show you that this little ballast does work. Uh, I've actually run it for about 20 minutes um, just to validate that uh, it would continue running because the biggest problem that I had with the old one was it would run light for about 30 seconds and then turn off. Um, so for about $8, I got my UV light working again instead of 60 and uh, hopefully you can too. Just one more addition that I that I thought of as I was putting this together and uh, finishing up the uh, heat shrink joints there. I actually added a uh, another green wire for the ground and I grounded the ballast that way uh, no matter how I mount this I, I think I'm just going to leave it open and, and screw it into the bottom of the, of the fish tank stand for now but um, that way this is grounded and uh, if you ever have any mishaps with water getting on this from the aquarium, then you won't die. So uh, to solder this on here, I actually took a little knife and scratched the paint off of the, uh, the ballast in that area and then uh, just hit that with a little bit of solder. Um, the uh, bare wire there. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.